Hey, how's it going, everybody? Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Wednesday, April 28th, 2021. Free play coming up in the NBA for Wednesday. We'll get to that in just a moment. Hey, first, a real quick thank you to those who jumped on board. That six-star play in the NHL yesterday on the Florida Panthers, a 7-4 win. Panthers had a big third period. That was enough to get us the win. And uh, this run in the NHL has been spectacular. In-season current run with all rented plays in the NHL now stands at $5,000 for $100 per unit betters. Even bigger than that, my high-end plays rented five stars and higher in the NHL. Going back to last season and including this season are now up almost $7,400 for $100 per unit players. So it's been an outstanding run. Again, thanks to those of you who jumped on board. Hit the seven star last Friday, hit the six star last night. And I do have an NHL play on today's card on Wednesday over on my homepage at DocSports.com. Also got the NBA 2-0 this week. We look to go to 3-0. Got a four-star play in the NBA on Wednesday night. And we're back in baseball action. I passed yesterday, as those of you who watched yesterday's video already know. Uh, but we're back with two plays, two sides on today's card on a Wednesday, including a five-star play, my second one of the season. We're off to a winning start so far this baseball season. Let's keep it going on uh, Wednesday. It all starts, by the way, with an afternoon play in soccer, where we're up over $3,800 since February 1st. All right, let's get to our free play for today. Oh, I wanted to mention also, don't forget about that $60 free account. If you're not yet a member at DocSports.com, just want to give it a trial run, click on that link below the video, get the free $60 account, which you can use on any of my daily packages or anybody else on the roster at DocSports.com. Let's get to the free play for today. Going to turn to the NBA. The Grizzlies lay in a, back, uh, excuse me, lay in a basket as I cut this video uh, at home to Portland. Third time since April 23rd, less than a full week that these two teams are going to hook up and meet. First two times happened in Portland. Portland was a favorite in both. Memphis won both games outright. I don't think the Blazers are going to get their revenge. Tough scheduling spot. They played last night in Indiana. Nice win for Portland. But that's not the reason we're not going to back Portland to get the revenge here. The reason is that I just don't like the way this team plays defensive basketball. Second worst in the NBA defensive efficiency this season overall. And only a tad better in the month of April on the defensive end when it comes to efficacy stats. As far as Memphis is concerned, I mean, we're talking about a team here uh, that has been playing a quick pace on offense all season long. It's the style they like to play. They've also stayed active on the defensive end. I think that comes into play in this particular game against Portland. Also, Memphis has covered 17 of 21 against teams that allow at least 106 points per game. They're also 12 and 4 against the spread off a double digit loss this season, which shows you how they bounce back off a bad defeat. They got clobbered the other night. It was the final game in a long road trip. They lost by 24 to Denver. They had yesterday off to group. They're now back home laying a bucket here and I like them to get the win, which would be three straight wins in less than a full week for the Memphis Grizzlies over the Portland Trailblazers. Again, free play for Wednesday, the Memphis Grizzlies minus the couple of points. All right, again, don't forget what I got going on on my homepage on a Wednesday at DocSports.com NBA Soccer NHL on that tremendous run. Two plays in Major League Baseball led by the star of the show for me today, which is a five-star play as we look to continue the positive, profitable season in Major League Baseball. If you like the videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Sprites of DocSports.com. Let's put Wednesday in the win column. Kentucky Derby info tomorrow. We'll talk to you then.